What's going on, everybody? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well, thanks for asking. Body beat down. Tuesday morning. <sighs> Get the old walk done a little bit early. Get off me. Attack of the flies again, guys. Attack of the flies. So, doing things kind of bass backwards. Got my uh, shower done already. Then I thought, well, I'll go ahead and get my walk done. <sighs> yeah, I got a doctor's appointment at 1030. So they can talk to me about what's going to happen when I get a colonoscopy. They have to schedule you an appointment, charge you money, so they can tell you what's going to happen. We know what's going to happen. But they got to make their money. So they charge you for that, just for coming in and saying, yeah, we're going to probe you. And then they charge you for doing the procedure. America. So yesterday was leg and tricep. Didn't do anything spectacular. My squats looked worse yesterday than I wanted. And my close grip bench press that's for the triceps, you know. I thought maybe I was, I wasn't sure, but I thought I was close to my PR. But it turns out my PR is 295 and not 285. So I didn't really get a PR or even match it. Because yesterday I just went to 285. But still happy with that. I got four reps. So that's pretty good. Did I get four reps? I don't know what I did. Maybe three, maybe two, maybe one. I don't know. Probably just one. I don't know what I did. Go watch the video. Maybe I need to watch the video. <sighs> so, got the doctor's appointment today, which means I'm going to have a car, which means I'm going to be thrown off my workout schedule a little bit so I can do it early like I did yesterday or a little or a little early. I can do it a lot early, a little early, or maybe a smidgen later. I don't know. I'm big on schedules. I'm big on keeping things the same. So when I'm out of school for the summers, like I am now, you know, I like to try and stay on track as if though I'm still in school. I like to try and keep my schedule the same. It makes me feel good. You know, that way when work starts back, you're not shocked with a, you know, doing things differently. You know, let's face it, during the summer, you know, I have the ability to do whatever for two months and really mess my schedules up. But if you can, it's best to try and stay on track and do things the same. For me, for my kind of personality, for my the way I am. So, anywho, so we got the doctor's appointment today. The car is still goofing up. We've been having some car problems over the past year or two, year and a half, something like that. I don't know. It's been a good car. I mean, it's getting old. But we can't seem to narrow it down and get it fixed. So, this Friday, I guess we're getting the spark plugs changed and getting the oil changed. I've already changed out the 
fuel pump. I did that myself, oddly enough. I'm not a mechanic by any means. <laughs> We've had the fuel line replaced. We've had, I don't know, all the fuel additives and stuff you can add. We've done everything but, I guess, change the plugs. Probably need to change all the filters, the cabin filters and all that mess that you got to change. Uh, they never been changed that I know of. So we're trying to make this car last a little while longer. It's a 2008 Nissan Altima. We're just over 100,000 miles. We got it when it had maybe 27,000 miles. We bought it when we lived in Las Vegas. So, <clears throat> it's been a good car, you know. No real issues other than whatever this is that's persistently being persistent. Just running a little rough and when you go to take off it's sluggish it's almost like the fuel is being held back and it's like you can press on the accelerator and it just kind of and then once it kicks in whatever it is the fuel or whatever it finally gets to or whatever's happening then it'll go it does that periodically where it's uh, uh, sluggish like so and then uh, and then it'll go and it's only when you stop so don't stop that's what my mom would say if she was still alive well don't stop so I don't know what it is I think it has something to do with fuel and the exhaust or something something in that something in that realm I could be wrong or it could be a, a chip going out a motherboard or whatever I don't know it could be something going out not a motherboard but a PCB or whatever it could be something going out I don't know I'm not a mechanic Things that need to be taught in school. Mechanic. Carpentry. Plumbing. Elect elect uh, electrician. <clears throat> Burping. The important things in life. Not all the garbage that they teach. Things that actually matter. Financing. <sighs> anyway, guys, today is chest and tricep day. And on the plate is flat barbell bench pressing. And triceps are going to probably be uh, tricep will probably be either Smith machine skull crushers which when I do them on the Smith machine I come down in this area that's what she said <laughs> oh my god anyway I bring the bar down around my face, oh, fa fa face area or if I do the dumbbell skull crushers, you know, I do the one dumbbell, two hand, lay down. With those, I go behind the head and then back up. Uh, so it'll, it'll be one of those two movements. One of those two. Same name, different techniques. <sighs> so anyway, guys, 
hope you have a good day do something healthy for yourself inside and out like share subscribe comment all that good stuff to the body beat down that's me your winded host Whew, boy putting on all that weight is warming out grief get up get out get red do it to it I need a breathing machine <laughs> see y'all later